today I'm going to show you how to delete part of the paper clip so that it looks more realistic like it's behind the photo. In Photoshop here I've just opened, I have a paper in the background and then my photo and then my paper clip is on top. So to start I'm just going to get my magic wand here and I want to make sure I have magic wand tool and I'm going to highlight the photo and I'm going to click off the photo so that all of the stuff in the background is highlighted. But what I really want is to have the photo, so I'm just going to go select inverse. So now the photo here is highlighted. And then I, I actually want to delete off the paper clip. And I'm just going to zoom in here a little so we can see. So right now, if I were to hit delete, all of the paper clip would be deleted, which is not what we want. So I'm going to get my lasso tool, and I like to use the polygon lasso tool. And I want to remove the part from the selection that I don't want to delete. Um, so I have my lasso tool, and I'm going to hold down Alt on the keyboard, so you can see this little minus sign on my mouse. So that will remove, and I'm just going to click here around this part of the paper clip. And so you will see now that's not that's not in the selection anymore. And my paper clip layer over here is selected. I'm just going to hit delete. And then deselect. And there you go. Now it looks like part of my paper clip is behind and the other part is in front.